Welcome back to Let's Play Psychonauts. I'm burning dog face and a giant lungfish is trying to kill me. Wheelchair, great. Another old wheelchair. I guess I gotta get all the bad stuff over by it so that when it inhales, this happens. Oh, god damn it! I just got that. When you smash the boxes and nails, they break! Would have seen that coming. Ooh. Come on, I got gotcha. you. They didn't like that, did you? Oh no, you're you're moving it. I didn't know you could do that. Oh, my leg. I was hoping for some health, and I got some, but it wasn't fast enough. Uh, okay, jumping over here. Oh no. <laughs> Can't see anything. Sorry, fish, you'll be fine in just a heartbeat. Uh. This is a really creepy view. This is second person view, where it's the perspective of someone who's looking at my character. Big guy, we're next. Uh. No, my organs. At least they give me checkpoints. We can just run. Way? No! Oh, I don't like this. It can move the the bubble wherever it wants. And I just have to react. Oh, I regret this plan immediately. Damn straight. Yeah, just, yeah, you're fine, fish. You'll be fine in just a heartbeat. Oh, there's no nails here! Oh, okay. Yeah! Nails! Tom, Tom. No. Uh. Yeah! Open wide, baby! Why is there a town down here? Oh, they flooded the valley. That's right. I knew that. Huh. I didn't think that tree lore would actually come in handy. What else was in there? 
Uh, Native American burial grounds. Something about, uh, oh, they built an insane asylum because everyone in town went crazy. The guy couldn't find the cure, and he ultimately threw himself on the roof. Yeah, I remember that, because, uh, he fell into despair when he realized there were more people in his, uh, institution than in the town! Please, no. Jump, man! Why can't I move? Great, I got stuck in the level geometry and lost a life. No, oh, fuck that. Stupid railing. Nothing? Uh uh. I hit the ceiling like an idiot. I don't think I'm even losing health for that, so that's nice. You know, they could have made that a lot shittier for me. Oh. Do you just want me to make a blind jump? Is that what it is? Yeah, it totally is, isn't it? Climb, 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 climb. I would really suck if you get it started pulling on the thing, by the way. It's pulling like in immediately the opposite direction. That sort of thing has gotten me a bunch of times in sequences where you're, someone else is in control of movement. You know, it's like, uh... You just let go in a tug of war, and they're so busy pulling in the opposite direction that they all fall down. Oh! Okay, that would have worked if that had... Man. I had properly modeled, I guess I wasn't supposed to go in that direction. I'm a marble. I'm over here now. Oh, God! Oh, it wants me dead. Yeah, I didn't think that was gonna work. I just thought I would give it a shot. And I can't try pyrokinesis, because you need to stop for that. Yeah, I give you a big old slap. Okay, I accidentally found the trick. I needed him to do that whip move. Ow! In front of one of these clams. Hey, I'll just stand over here. It'll be fine. Oh no, what'll I do? I'm gonna bitch slap you is what I'm gonna do. Try not to think about the hands. Go, you can catch these hands. Ah, oh, poor little thing. That poor little thing yeah. just tried to kill me about eight different ways. Well, that's not its fault. This was once just a normal-sized lungfish, minding its own business in a mucus-lined air bubble beneath a semi-dry leg bed. But judging by the work done on it, I suspect Maury has mutated it, accelerated its growth, and has placed an implant in its brain to make it do his evil bidding. Whoa. Poor little thing. Yeah, yeah, okay. Go inside there and try to smash the implant. Use the psycho portal I saw you steal from Sasha's lab. Oh, uh, yeah. That works on big scary monsters. What, the door? Oh, monster schmonster. That thing's more afraid of you than you are of it. Now get in there. You know how I actually look at you? God damn. I kind of agree with the assessment. You are not having a great time. Whoa. Poor little thing. I still don't know what the fucking feather is for. Alright.
Brace yourselves, guys. We're going in! Oh. This I was not expecting. I can honestly say that. Top of the morning to you, ma'am. And good day to you, Officer of Lungfish. How are you today? Oh, damp and happy, can't complain. And what are you and the wee one up to on this lovely day? Oh, just obeying the law as always. All posted directives followed to the letter. Ah, good to hear. Not a one of us want any trouble, that's for sure. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, Gagalo! Get to Kachamura Tower and destroy it? Oh! Oh, jeez! Oh my god, they're doing a riff on the original Godzilla music. <laughs> I'm a fucking kaiju! No, that guy just stopped. Just, nope, I ain't going under, under that foot. No, 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 no. You can do whatever the fuck you... Oh, jeez. God. It just wants to be normal. It just wants to be normal again. It created a whole city of normal lungfish being happy. And I'm the monster who came down into the lake and beat the shit out of it. My jumping uh, physics are very different. I don't think that's gonna work. I don't think that's gonna work. Too heavy. Yep. Sorry. It's, it's walking animation too. <laughs> hey, Gogaloy! Down here! Hi. Excuse me. Were you talking to me? Ah, ow, my ears. I'm sorry. Ah, oh my god. Ah. Are you okay? He's dead. Oh jeez, I'm sorry. Don't worry. Every member of the resistance is prepared to die fighting the tyranny of Kochamara. What's Kochamara? He's a giant monster like you, Gogalor. He brainwashed and enslaved almost everyone in Lungfishopolis. That stinks. So, hey, have you seen any other humans around here? I'm looking for a girl called Lily. The government archives might have some information about your young girlfriend, Gogalor. Yeah, I don't know if she's really my girlfriend. I mean, I think she... I only meant that she is your friend who was a girl, Gogalor. To access the archives, we must first destroy the broadcast tower Kochamara uses to control the populace. Check. Okay. I'll go smash that, then. Wait, Gogalor. In order to reach the tower, you'll need to pass through that wall of lasers. But you'll never make it through the lasers without our help. So are you gonna start helping soon? First, I need you to do something for the Resistance. Punch a hole in that prison and free my comrades! I'm just gonna wait till those, you know... It's Gogglar! He hates children! <laughs> oh my god, the orphanage. Freedom! 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 Hoo-ya! Now, how about getting me past those gates? Right. We stole the shield power module from Coach Amara. It's too big for any of us to operate, but it should work for you. I was not expecting that, but okay, I'll take that. Thank you. What the hell is going on? Upset Kochamra and all your little brainwashed neighbors? No, I doubt it. Uh, no, no. So knocking down the prison and then breaking this laser shield thing? Nobody's gonna get mad about that and start shooting at me. No. 
Uh, maybe one guy would. But what is even an entire navy of lungfish against the might and revolutionary zeal of Gogalore? Wait. Oh my god. What navy? Meet us at the dam, Gogalore. For freedom! Use your psychic shield to protect you from damage and reflect some enemy attacks back at the attacker. Note, you will not be able to maintain a psychic shield forever, and when this part of your mind is exhausted, you'll need to wait a while before you use it again. So he's... So the mind control implant is represented in the fish's mind as the entire population being brainwashed. Leon, that wasn't the orphanage. Oops. The peaceful city of Lungfishopolis is under attack tonight by a hideous gigantic monster the terrified citizens have named Gogolor. The Navy has responded quickly and decisively, oh my God. dispatching its entire tank division to neutralize the creature. Soon, authorities say, everything will return to normal or better. Kidnapping human children is good. Um... Rez, not to, like, shit on your rescue plans or anything, but this is all a metaphor. You're not going to find Lily in here. Is that where I came from? Yeah, it is. How in the hell am I meant to get up Why, with that? Why? Oh, that worked a lot easier than I thought it would. Oh, I can just climb. Just fucking rampage my way up. Nothing can stop him. Oh, that's good. Well-made building. Oh my god, the footprints. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Even for this game's standards! Try not to step on anybody! Oh uh, no! Oh. It was the orphanage! For dogs! It was the puppy orphanage, That's everyone! Be hell, Gogalore! <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah, I should probably equip that new power, huh? Yeah, that doesn't work, so let's do that. I thought it was supposed to reflect it. What? Oops, that guy's dead. Sploosh. Oh, there's an island there! God damn it! Oh, I missed. I was worried about that, but hey, now we're here. I'll take that. Go in there, and it still blows up, so I don't feel so bad. I need this boat, and that building, and that building. Got it close enough? Get it, get it, get it? Okay. I just stepped on that motherfucker. Sorry, I'm just enjoying this too much. Where am I actually supposed to be going? Uh, rendezvous with the dissidents at the dam. Ah. That's a big dam for these little guys. You're gonna be my extra special friend. I hope nobody you know lives there. Oops, sorry. Sorry! Stop that. Where are these? Ah, there you are. Well, things have gotten a little embarrassing for Gagalore. Recently surfaced information has strongly linked the previously intimidating monster with common low-life criminals. Earlier tonight, Gagalore broke some of his jailhouse cronies out of the slammer so they could enjoy a night on the town, popping pills and soliciting inexpensive call girls. Well, they're in for one nasty hangover. Our beloved Navy has come up with a high-tech new invention. Trucks armed with hyper-electricity. Kidnapping children do not harm the brains. Oh, 
gonna borrow this for just a moment. That's not really a building. I can't take cover behind that. Bring it. Hell yes. I reflected the shit out of that attack. Missed. I think he's literally sticking his hands in the windows. It took me a while to get going there because I'm so goddamn big. Like, that would probably break windows right there, hitting the ground. Oh, palm bronze upgrade. Oh, right, it's feet in here. You know, because I'm a hideous monster and all that. Oops, sorry. My bad. I hope you were not a metaphor for some important part of the brain. I'm just gonna hide past this warehouse and do a sign off. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you next time on Let's Play Psychonauts when we go deeper into the lungfish's brain and I guess meet up with the local resistance and play along with the story. This is gonna be a weird one. Later.